To set up approval templates for activities, navigate to Activities and then Activity Setup. Click on Approval Risk Assessment. You'll notice the screen is divided into three sections – Approval Templates, Risk Assessment Templates and Notifications. We'll focus on Approval Templates. The first thing to notice is that there will be a default template waiting there for you. In this example, there are also three others which have been created. You can make your own template by entering a name and then clicking Add New Template. Be careful with this because if you don't enter a name but press the button anyway, you'll create a template with no name and this may confuse you. We can remove that by clicking on the Remove button. In a moment, we'll take a look at what's in the Approval Request template. But before doing that, let's make a copy of it. The reason for that is that the approval templates can be quite long and complicated, and you may not want to start from scratch. Let's call this version 2. Now let's take a closer look. The first thing to be aware of is that the template is divided into sections. If I scroll down a bit, you can see them here. Notice that some are longer than others. These are the sections your staff will need to work through when going through the approval process for your activity. You can create a new section here. Be mindful again that if you don't actually enter a name for your section, but press the Add Section button anyway, you'll create a section with no name and this may appear confusing. Scrolling down to the bottom, you can see this mystery section that I've just created, here. Let's delete it. Sections can also be reordered by dragging them up and down with the hamburger icon. And notice also that you can copy an entire section. Inside each section are fields where staff can enter relevant details. These fields can also be reordered by dragging them with the hamburger icon. To add or rename a field within a section, use these buttons here. Notice also that each field can be edited. This allows you to change the name and also change the type of entry you want staff to make. In doing so, you can customise the field to suit your exact needs. The same edit features are available when you add a field. This process is repeated down the length of this template. Each field covers a different aspect of your activity. Keep in mind that this is a default approval template which we have copied for our own purposes. You might find this template far too long and complicated for your needs, so feel free to delete sections as necessary or start from scratch.